Hello, this is Vampire, and for today's lesson, we're going to be focusing on the abanico technique. When I first learned this technique, it was in Arnis, and at, at the time, I wasn't able to fully appreciate the technique because I didn't really understand it too well. Uh, later on, over the years, I've come to realize that the abanico blends in very well with other movements, and once you're able to do that, it really takes your screamer skills to the next level. So. Uh, that's my goal today, is to help you guys transfer the abanico technique instead of just one other technique into more part of your escrima movements. Okay, so first we need to know what the abanico technique is. So this is what it looks like. It goes one, two. It's a double strike, and I always imagined it to be like a ceiling fan because it's up here, and I believe it means fan. Okay, so it goes one, two, just like that. One, two. So that's the abanico technique. Um, so what I did here was I put it into a small package that's going to show uh, three different uh, planes that you're going to be striking at. So it'll kind of give you a better uh, picture of how to use the abanico in different angles. So uh, let me just show you how it looks like, okay? So it goes one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, and three. All right, so let's break that down. This is what I'm actually doing. In the abanico technique, it's normally two strikes right here. It goes one, two, but instead, we're just gonna do one strike, okay? So from here, one strike, and then I come back to just a parking position. So from this position right here, I'm gonna change, because that was the top plane, okay? I was doing it up here. Now I'm going to change it to the side plane right here. So now it's sideways, okay? So it's going to travel in this area. So I'm going to uh, strike this way towards my opponent, and then I'm going to come back once again to this parking position. And now I'm going to change planes again to the front plane, okay? And it's going to go this way, you see? This is kind of like a defensive swipe movement right here, a parry, if you want to call it that. So now I strike, strike this way, and then I come back to the parking position right here. From here, I go to the top, park, side, park, front, park. Top, park, side, park, front, park. So it goes one, two, three. And then you could continue doing the motion over and over again. So it covers all the areas there, those angles right there for you. Three different planes. So I hope you enjoy the, the technique. Please practice. And take care.